So, okay, before we go on a break, I, I, I wanted to have a discussion. I, I wanted to talk about uh, the headband. Okay. That I wore a few days ago yesterday. I wore it yesterday. Okay, yes, so here's you wore it the story. yesterday. Yeah, so here's the story. My wife has this headband, and she wears it all the time to get her hair out of her face. And Bella and I have watched too much Lucha Underground. Yes. So it got to the point where mommy comes out and, and she, you know, she's in a huff. She's in a hurry. She has to go somewhere and she has her headband on and she has her sunglasses on. And I lean over to Bella and I'm like, hey, how much does she look like Johnny Mundo right now? Mm -hmm. Looks like Johnny mm -hmm. Mundo. She's going to go hang out with Taya and the rest of the worldwide underground and beating up Prince Puma. <laughs> so it, it just it, I got it in my head that like okay when she puts this headband down I'm gonna put it on maybe I can be cool like Johnny Mundo from yeah. Lucha Underground so I put it on and I looked at myself in the mirror and I'm like okay this is a woman's headband and sure it's got like owls on it but I but I when I look in the mirror I see like a long haired Mexican wearing a band a bandana and I yeah. don't know I think I look pretty damn cool I so, think it looks pretty cool. Yeah, so that was like a couple of weeks ago. So yesterday, but it's but it's it, funny how some people can pull off a look and some people can't. Yeah, yeah. You know? uh, I yeah, could yeah. not pull off that look. Yeah, but I'm going. I'm going somewhere else with this. Go ahead. But but I I I all all the kids go to school and Natasha leaves for school and I'm about to leave for work, but Oh crap. I forgot my phone. It's still charging in my bedroom. I'm going to run and get it. So I ran and got my phone. And then on the bed, I see mommy left her headband and uh -huh. I say, screw it. Executive decision. I'm calling an audible. I get the headband. I put it on my head and I drive to work and I don't think about it. But again, I've got like a 45 to 50 minute drive and I have way too much time to um, live in my own head. <laughs> yes. So I start thinking like we're in Oklahoma, we're in the Bible belt. We're in the middle of white pride America. Mm -hmm. And here is this long haired Mexican wearing a woman's headband. Like I'm asking for it. So I'm starting <laughs> to like, like worry and I'm starting to get nervous. And uh, here, here's a, a, a secret. Um, I really worry that I'm going to be late for work. I'm always worried. I'm going to get a flat tire. Yeah. The, like, the car is going to stall. So I leave pretty super early. And most of the time I get to work about a half hour early, but then Ooh. that's way too early. So I will wait like in the parking lot adjacent to our parking lot for a while. So I'll just be in front of like the Ross dress for less. Yes. Uh, watching YouTube videos and listening to the news and waiting for like five or 10 minutes until I can really get to work. Yes. So I'm just there in the parking lot of Ross dress for less. And I'm really like, I've, I've worked myself into a tizzy about this women's headband so i take a <laughs> selfie of myself and i post it on instagram and facebook and i say quick question do i look good or ridiculous wearing my my wife's owl headband please comment soon i'm on my way to work i'm about to go into work yeah. and i get a bunch of comments and they're all positive and they're all mm -hmm. these people that kind of like me like uh like sierra who really likes me when she's not sober is yeah. all like you look good, do it. And Lori, who who likes me, she's like, oh, you can pull off anything. And and all of these people are saying these really good things. You look great, and you can pull it off. And go for it. You look amazing. And and yada yada yada. Like like really positive stuff. And so yeah. suddenly I'm feeling good. I'm feeling confident. I go to work, into work, and I'm wearing this headband. I even I'm at work and I Snapchat myself. Yeah. in my receiving area and says i'm rocking this headband today and so i'm <laughs> working and then people at work are giving me compliments too one person said that i look like johnny depp not just because i was wearing uh skinny jeans and a uh, headband yeah but also uh, i have a habit of needing rubber bands in receiving so i will go I will put like eight or ten different rubber bands on my wrist. 
uh-huh. in the morning so I can use those rubber bands throughout the day at work. And so it, it was it was like the headband and the skinny jeans and the fact that I had like stuff around my – I looked Johnny yeah. Depp. Yes. You know? But all I needed was nine scarves <laughs> and and a few more crappy tattoos. And then I would have achieved full depthness. Yes. And then one other person, another person I work with looked at me and said, are you in a band? <laughs> and I'm like, okay, that's kind of cool. Like maybe like Axl Rose when he was still relevant. Or yeah. Something like, like I'm look, I'm feeling really good and I'm feeling confident and I feel like I look really good. Then. One person I know, Facebook messages, Facebook messages me. Yeah. And she says, hey, Steve, how you doing? And I'm, I say, oh, I'm doing good. I haven't heard from you in a while. So what are you up to? And she said, oh, nothing. I'm just on Facebook. <laughs> you look like an ugly lesbian with that thing on your head. Uh huh. Really? See, yeah. I I don't I don't I don't see how owls denote male or female. You know, yeah. I I don't I, I don't look at owls. I, I would not see owls and think, oh, that's a woman's headband, like yeah. at all. Yeah, I I I think it was just due to the fact that I again I have like a fifty minute drive. I have a lot of time to think, and I just thought myself into like a corner. Yeah, but. Like I got like ten really good compliments, but then I got the one negative compliment, and yeah. she said, "You look like an ugly lesbian. You might as well put some eyeliner and makeup on." LOL. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, but then I thought, okay, this okay. is one negative comment versus ten positive comments. Yeah. I'm stronger than this. Mm-hmm. I'm not going to let one negative comment negate. 10 positive comments. I've had more positive comments than negative comments. This is just one comment. I am yeah. stronger than this. Well, apparently, I am not stronger than that. Okay. And I took what the headband happened? off. And I have not worn it since. And I feel so ashamed. But yeah, yeah, yeah. The one negative comment, just all I could think of was just ugly lesbian for the rest of the day. And I'm like, damn it, I... I it, I thought I was stronger than this, but I got to take this shit off, so I took it off. I I I, I didn't see that at all. Yeah, no, one person did. Just one person did. Honey, did you think he looked like an uh, an ugly lesbian in that headband with the owls? Yeah. No, no, Jeannie didn't think so either. If anything, I looked like a handsome lesbian. Yeah, exactly. But yeah, that's my headband story. I'm not as strong as I thought I was, and I took that shit off. Yeah, I, yeah, I, I'm sensitive. Thank you, Bella. I'm a sensitive man. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it's not like it had unicorns or strawberry shortcake on it or anything yeah. like that. It wasn't like pink or anything. It didn't I, have rainbows on it. Yeah, why? Why can't a guy like owls? Well, the yeah. thing, the thing about it was. That at first you don't notice. I didn't notice the owls. Yeah. Until you said there were owls on it, and then I laughed, yeah. and then yeah. I laughed. Like, oh, geez, yeah. if you hadn't said anything, nobody would have noticed. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so I just worked myself into a tizzy. Maybe one day I'll try and wear it again and see if I yes. can wear it the entire day. But do you? Do you yeah. For things like that, anything that 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 you're posting about in the morning, I don't get around to that till much later. So, I, like, I won't comment on it. You know, like you're probably home by then. You know, yeah, yeah. So it, I didn't comment on it. I was trying to think of a funny comment that I could put on it because if I can make a joke, I'm posting it. it doesn't make a difference yeah. what time it is. Yeah, but I couldn't quite come up with it. It's funny because I it, it's become clockwork of like uh like I I'm at work and I'm occasionally checking Facebook because I'm kind of I'm I'm in receiving I'm in my own universe I can check texts and I can check messages and talk to people and stuff more so than any other person in the store so. Yeah. It's always funny because like, oh, I'm checking Facebook and then, okay, now I'm going to go and do this thing and I'm not going to check it for a while. 
and then it's like four, three o'clock, four o'clock, something like that. And I check my phone and I'm like, oh, suddenly you have eight Facebook notifications. And yeah. I'm like, ah, bunny's up. <laughs> and then like, I'm I, and it, like, it, it's clockwork and it's beautiful. And I'm like, oh, bunny's finally catching up for all the shit I did on Facebook today. Yes. Good, good, good to know. And then there's always the like, I'm I'm halfway done with my drive. I'm almost home. And yeah. then suddenly I get one or two notifications or like a comment. And I'm like, ah, there's Jeannie. Jeannie's <laughs> on. Thump. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Jeannie's off work because she just said something on one of my pictures. <laughs> That's how it works. It's clockwork. It's wonderful. I have my own internal clock. It's really great. Yeah. 